Hi, I'm Yvonne Gao. I'm an experimental physicist and I build hardware for quantum computers. All of us are probably familiar with laptops or smartphones, which are basically classical computers. Uh, they operate on something called a bit, which is binary, and they can only exist in zero or one, but never at the same time. In contrast to this, a quantum computer could operate on something called a qubit or a quantum bit. A qubit has the special property of being able to exist in both zero and one at the same time, and this could potentially offer us unparalleled computational power in the future. So what are quantum computers useful for? Uh, well, quantum computers are usually good at tackling problems that involve many interacting parts. As a result, we can think of applications in modeling weather patterns for climate change, simulating chemistry reactions, as well as optimizing logistic problems. While quantum computers offer tremendous promises in many different sectors, it does also pose some challenges for us. For example, it has the potential to break our current encryption codes, which could cause a big security problems for all of us. As scary as that might sound, it's not all lost because we can use quantum encryption codes to actually safeguard our data and make that future-proof and unbreakable. And that's really cool. Quantum computing is a really exciting field right now, and there's a lot more to be done. Uh, that's why people like myself are actively working on building better hardware for these computers. I'm also really looking forward to find out about the new applications that we'll develop as we learn more about this technology.